Don't go far. Huh? Don't go far. This is my neck on my head. Hello, everyone. Hello, sir. Oh, you got a guest that's going to be taking class with us? Yeah, I'm sure she'll, uh, she'll move here shortly. <laughs> <laughs> got it. All right. Once again, if you guys notice some glitchiness in the, in the video or the audio, please let me know. Um, I think it seems like it's working okay, so we're gonna we're gonna try to run with this. Um, I'm trying to avoid getting new technology installed in over here, but I may have to when push comes to shove. But we'll see. So, all right, we're gonna give a couple minutes and then we'll get started. So, yes, sir. Hello, ma'am. Are you taking class today? No, <laughs> not yet. Come on, ma I'm going to be here doing my my exercise, though. <laughs> you should be doing our exercise, not your exercise. Our exercise is better. Yeah. <laughs> I should I should get myself to the fitness level that I can start doing those exercises. Oh, you don't need to be doing that. <laughs> any any level can start this. <laughs> How was your wife's birthday, sir? I'm sorry, what was that? How was your wife's birthday? Oh, uh, you know, we made the best of it, you know, considering we can't go out or anything. So, yeah. um, I cooked via Olive Garden. Oh, okay. Via Olive Garden, so, <laughs> <laughs> you know. So, I baked a cake via King Supers, so, or a okay. cheesecake via King Supers, so, everything was fine, you know. <laughs> she, got, she got a lot of nice things, stuff for the family. She was happy considering. Yeah. All right. Let's see, you got a few more people joining us right now, so. So as I was saying, if, if you notice that the, the video or the audio is still glitchy, um, cutting in and out, please let us know. Yeah, it, uh, it seemed to be okay. Uh, when The other night when you used the phone, Mm -hmm. uh, only towards the end, there was one part where the voice just, uh, it, it was fast Yeah. for a small section, but otherwise it was pretty good, sir. Okay. Yeah. So I've got, like I said, I've got a headset from Amazon coming in um, that's supposed to help where it'll go directly into the computer instead of using the computer mic. I'm going to have an actual uh, piece that's okay. right in my mouth. So it's okay. going to be directly in. Um, I'm really, like I said, for our purposes today, really, if the, if the video quality gets really bad or if it starts to skip a, lo uh, a lot, then let me know. Yes. Because uh, I think I've got the setup ready for, for those that are going to start coming to class next week. 
we're still gonna we're gonna film i'm gonna try to film as many classes as i can from here even if we end up having to kind of shut down because i just okay. noticed at least with the lighting here everyone can kind of see my feet a little bit better than hidden in my uh in my carpet uh, my downstairs is kind of dark as it is and so forth so um yeah we're going to try to utilize this as much as we can so all right i just yeah, told we'll you, when you started this i told Spo just no more snow days <laughs> exactly, <laughs> right because right. this will be ongoing like i said at this point since we've gotten so much positive response from it i'm just going to run this for pretty much almost every class um the Facebook Live, we're going to also try to do as well because we're seeing that people are watching through Facebook Live. Um, but um, this is the Zoom is going to be the priority because at least I can see uh, see the students and be able to get feedback because I've got my basically I've got my projector set up now so that I can project it onto my my movie screen. Okay. Um, so I can kind of um, see everyone a little bit better and give you that feedback. That's the biggest thing, you know, as yeah. from an instructional. Point. Yes, I can sit here and call commands all day long right. to give you that feedback, just like you guys are in class is, is critical. So we're going to keep doing this going forward. I, once we get to the new norm where we, we can get full size classes, I'm not sure how the, the video and stuff is going to look. Uh, we'll have to adjust some things around and so forth. But um, the intent is that we're going to try to keep this going as long as we can. So, okay. all right. Great. All right. Let's go ahead and get started, everyone. Let me put everyone on mute here. We'll get started. All right. Let's line up, please, everyone. All right. From here, face me. Get up. Come here. Let's warm it up. Hands and hips. Rotate your neck side to side. Hana. Good. Set. Up and down. Hana. Legs 
straight out in front of you this time. Reach forward and grab a hold of those toes. Pull them back towards you and try to lift your heels up off the ground a little bit. Ready? Hana! Outside and then straighten out your legs as far as you can without letting go. All right, leaning forward. Ready? Hana!
Very good. Turn around. You look good. All right, from here. Stepping up, reverse side kick. Knife hand punch. Stepping up, reverse side kick this time. Ready? Hello! Remember, you're stepping in a circle, right? Good. Do those. Hello! Hey. Good. Stop it. You want to step forward, Miss Addie, right? Step forward and turn in a circle. Do those. Hello! Hey. 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 You want to step forward and then do your reverse side kick. Turn in the circle. Hey. Hey, make sure you're not hooking. Turn around. You go.
Ta-da! Yeah, I... All right, this time from here. Let's do skip side kick now, please. Skip side kick. Back to sponge. Ta-da! I... Ta-da! Turn around, you lose it all. Okay, 
Okay, this time from here, chunge and step, and then reverse side kick, please. Chunge and step, reverse side kick this time. Ready? Hello! Okay. Turn around, you little Come closer to the screen, please, uh, Miss Rochelle as well. All right. So stay in your fighting sense. Okay. Stay in your fighting sense. So we're gonna do some hujin steps. Remember the hujin step. Step back one. Kick off the back leg. Put it down in front. Okay. So we're not moving forward. We're not moving back. We're just kind of maintaining our space. All right. So we're gonna do some hujin steps. So let's do hujin step. Reverse side kick, everyone. So you're gonna step back one. Turn. Kick toward the screen. Don't kick your screen. Don't stand too close where you can kick your screen. All right, give yourself enough room, but you want to kick toward the screen and put it down. Ready? Hana! Who just step kick? One, two. Yay. Put it down in front. Good. Now the other leg. Ready? Good. Shuffle. Kick. Aya! Come back. Mr. Swogis, you need to kick toward the screen. Okay? Ready? Set. Move back away from the screen. Yeah, kick to the screen. Kick toward me. Turn around. Or, I'm sorry. Ready. Set. Sorry, keep doing the same thing. Kick, kick toward the screen. Sorry. Yeah. Just force a habit. Okay, good. Ready. The sun. Move back away from the screen. Kick toward yeah. the screen. There you go, Mr. Slow. Just good. Again, ready. The sun. Same thing. Turn the other way, Mr. Yeah. Slow. Just good. Kick toward me. Kick toward the screen. Up, Mr. Soldiers. Ready? Yeah. All right, come on. Sure. Relax, go ahead and take a quick break, get some water. <coughs> Any issues with the video at all? When you, uh, sir, when you walked off to the side, 
uh, I guess towards the uh, front of the classroom. Uh -huh. We're hard to hear. Got it. Yeah, but with that headset coming, it should alleviate that. Yeah, it's going to, yeah. So it's it's going to feed directly into the computer. So the computer's not using the, the mic that's built in, so. Yes, sir. Yep. So I'm just anxious. As a random it. suggestion. Yes. Tried using Bluetooth headphones. Um. So Bluetooth headphones typically have a built-in mic oh. that you could try and speak into. I will try that. I'm not sure. Yeah, I'm not sure if my laptop has that capability. It's a, it's a little bit dated. My laptop is so I will check though. I'll try that. But I've got like I've got a nice headset coming. So that's gonna it's a U. It basically plugs into the USB port. So, all right. But yeah, that's um, I will try that. I'll I'll try some stuff with the group tomorrow. I've got a instructor meeting tomorrow and um, some training. So I'll try that tomorrow and see. Thank you. All right. Okay, so we're gonna go through all the forms. Once you're done, once we've gotten up to your form for your belt, then um, once we stop, um, right after we're done with your form, go ahead and go to your, um, your three-step sparring and your one-step sparring, okay? Um, then once everyone is done with all their forms, then we're gonna, um, we're gonna basically spend most of our time on the one steps and takedowns to finish out the class. Okay. Yeah. So, all right. So from here, well, I'll go ahead and have Natalie and Isaiah face your direction. Yeah. All right. So let's start from here. Chumbe, we're gonna skip keep on air chong. We're gonna go right into take a gear chong. All right. Yellow belt pumte. Take a gear chong in your own count. Ready, she jump. Back to your two-man position. All right, step forward back to your starting spot if you had room. All right, from here, let's move on. Take a e jump. Get ready. She jump. All right, whoa, back to your two-man position. All right, you should be right back where you started if you had room to do your entire boom set. All right, for me at this time, take a sum jump. Get ready, she took. Oh, back to your treatment position. All right, Mr. Swojas, practice your three steps sparring and your one steps, please. Everyone else, let's move on. Take Oaks Hajong.
All right, this time from here. Hegok Ojang. Hegok Looks good, Mr. Sorges. Keep it up. Okay, once you're done with your three steps, go to one steps, please. Okay, hold on. All right, very good. This time for me, Miss Addy, go ahead and work on your three steps and one steps. For a little bit, please. Everyone else this time. Take a yuk chung. She took. Oh, Mr. Hammer, it is going to be the right hand, left hand at the, yeah, at the very end. All right, hold on, back to your treatment position. All right, Mr. Frey, Mr. Hammer, go ahead and do your three steps firing left side and then work on some of those one steps left side for just a little bit. All right, it'll be really quick though. All right, from here, cheer chung this time. Take a cheer chung. Working on those one steps, Mr. Sorges. Hello. Alright, let's move on. Black Pig of Pipe Oh. All right, this time, Cordio. Cordio, this time. She took.
Miss Rochelle. All right, show, relax. All right, get some water if you need it. We're gonna go right into some quick one steps for blue belts and up. Mr. Swoges, I want you to keep practicing the one steps that you've been working on. Okay. I want you to practice a lot on that one where you do the double knife hand chop and then you do the knee and head and then the elbow. Okay. All right, so blue belts and up, right? So when your opponent punches, right? So, right from here, when Isaiah punches towards you here, right? What you're gonna do is you're gonna do an upper knife hand block. You're gonna step in with your left leg. You're gonna step into the outside of Isaiah's foot. Okay, so you wanna step to this side here. You're gonna do your upper knife hand block. Remember Tegu's hajang? Right, when you come forward and you do this, Right? This moment here, that's what you're going to do. So you're going to step forward with that left leg, right? Into front stance toward him. You do upper knife hand block and knife hand strike at the same time. Okay? All right, pretty simple, right? Just, just think of it as like number two, but you're just doing it this way, right? Now you have an option here, right? You can also, once you do the strike here, one, you can grab the head with that right hand and then bring the right knee in. All right? So you got an option there. You got that? Grab a knee, or you can just do a front kick off the right leg, right? One. Right? No, no knee strike on the front kick, though, right? So from a side view, okay? So what happens here? You've got the knee, this one here where you go this way, or you got this straight into front kick. Okay, yep. So if you go here, then basically, once you're here, your hand wraps around and then pulls down, and then you do your knee strike, okay? All right, so that gives you two handle, uh, one with a hand and leg only, right? Both of them are hand and leg, right? So when you get to that red belt level, you have to start breaking these out. So hand only, leg only, hand leg, all right, and then take down. So, all right, that gives you a couple of hand leg ones. All right, so from here, um, let's do some takedowns here real quick, right? Let's just do that quick review. All right, so remember from here, right? I'm stepping across with my right leg. One, step back with my left hand, left leg, spin to the right side, lift, right? Lift, one, turn to the right, side kick down. Okay. All right, then I've got the next one where I'm going to step on the inside of his leg, right? All right, on the inside of his leg. One, upper arcane strike, right? I'm going to get up underneath, underneath the elbow. Face punch, gut punch, right? So face and gut. And then I'm going to pull to my right. All right, sweep. One, and then punch with that right hand. Or like in Mr. Hammer's case, in Mr. Ferreira's case, foot stomp. Right, once you sweep here, one, lift, lift that right leg and foot stomp. Because trying to punch down toward the ground at your height, right, and your build, very difficult, especially if the person's already on the ground. So you're just gonna stomp on them. All right, okay, all right, next one. From here, all right? We did the one where we stepped to the left side, palm block, double punch, right leg grabs. Remember the right leg side kick to the back of the knee all the way through, right? And then left elbow strike. So this is where you're holding on to that hand, right? I'm holding up when he's down on the ground here so he doesn't fall all the way to the ground. I'm gonna pull him toward me. And at the same time, I'm gonna do my elbow strike. So it's this motion. Then, in essence, you're pulling with the right hand and you're striking with the elbow. Okay? Make sure you transition into that front stance when you do that, right? You kick through one and land in a front stance. 
and then that way you rotate the hip. Okay? Good. All right? We've got the same one where we step to the side. One palm. Three punches this time, right? It doesn't matter how you do it. Three middle punches, high punch, low punch, high punch, whatever you want to do, but three punches. One, one, two, three. All right? Then left hand grabs the shoulder. And remember, you're going to pull back. And you're going to kick with the left leg. You're going to kick that front leg out. One, this way. And then you're going to step. You're going to punch or you're going to stomp. Right foot's going to stomp. Obviously, this is all right hand side. When we do that left hand side, you're going to have to reverse everything. All right, Mr. Hammer, Mr. Ferrer, when you do the left side, you kind of have to reverse everything. So I would encourage you as you're practicing, do the right side first, and then immediately go to the left side technique just to make sure you got that down, okay? So when you go to the left side, yeah, right hand grabs, right leg's gonna come up, right? So you're gonna pull and right leg this way, one. And then left hand punches or left foot stomps. Left foot stomps, all right? Okay? All right. So next one, right, we, we did the one Basically, we're going to use the, the, the side kick one that we did and the, this sweep one, the pull sweep one on this next technique, right? you got two more takedowns using this very beginning portion. So right leg steps across your body, steps this way. One, I'm going to do a right knife hand strike to his, to his kidney. My left foot comes around, knife hand strike here. Okay? Then I'm going to do a ridge hand strike here underneath. Now, if I do two punches, one, two, right? Then I'm going to grab with my left hand the shoulder. And then I'm going to kick up and sweep. One, foot stomp or punch, right? So that sweep is the exact same as the one we did with the palm block. We're just starting it different. We're, gonna, we're going a little bit fancier, right? We're stepping across. One, two, three. One, two, sweet. Ten. Oh, ten. So now, when we do that same one, we're going to do that same beginning, just like we did. So one. One, two, three. Ten. Now, right hand is at the ridge hand, right? You come across this way. Now, what we're going to do, left hand, right? Left hand grabs. Then, left leg side kick to the knee. Boom. And then, right elbow. All right? Let's try that one again. So, step across, knife hand, knife hand, ridge hand. All right, single punch, I'm sorry. So left hand should punch, right? And then right hand grab, sorry, I did that wrong. So then right hand grabs. So knife hand, knife hand, ridge hand, left hand punch, right hand grabs, right leg side kick, and then elbow. All right? So basically the grab, Side kick, elbow movement is the same as the other takedown. We're just starting it off differently. Okay? Right, so we're doing it with the knife hand, spin knife hand, ridge hand technique. Okay? Now, right, so Miss Addie, go ahead and keep working on those. All right, get, get your footwork down and everything. All right, Mr. Ferrer, Mr. Hammer, right? We're going to do the same thing to start. We're going to do that knife hand, ridge hand. But instead of doing the, the ridge hand this way, right? when we get to the knife hand, the second knife hand, now what we're going to do is we're going to step in with my right leg. I'm going to step behind him. And instead of coming underneath for my ridge hand, I'm going to come over his hand. And I'm going to basically go at his opposite shoulder here. One. Okay? So basically, I'm stepping through, boom, and then I'm going to basically pivot. I'm going to turn, throw him over my leg, right? And then punch with that left hand or left leg foot stop. 
Okay? So when you do that, remember, step knife hand, spin, knife hand, step through, close line, close line, flip them over your shoulder, your hip. Okay? Step through. There you go. Good. Yep. Okay? And so it's basically a clothesline attack. So you're aiming to you're aiming to go for that opposite shoulder when you come across. Then, okay. all right, yep. Go ahead and do that one again. Make sure you got it. It looks good, Mr. Slow. Just good job. All right. So here's another one. So this time from here, what we're gonna do is we're going to step with our left leg. We're gonna step forward. We're gonna do a knife hand block, all right? So when they punch, you're gonna step in, make sure you step on the outside of their foot, and you're gonna do a knife hand block, okay? Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna step through with your right leg. So you're gonna step to your left side, into a front sense here. At the same time you do that, you're gonna go straight up into what we call a chin strike, all right? So here, when you step through, like this, all right, so your right, your left hand grabs the arm, and your right hand is going to attack that chin. Okay, so what's going to happen, Isaiah? Come here. Okay, what's going to happen here? Right, when Isaiah punches, I did my block. I stepped on the outside of his foot. When I step through, I get behind him and I go to his chin. And then what I do from here is I'm going to kick my right leg back. So if you can see his foot, right, my right foot comes back here like this. You see, I'm gonna take him down that way. As I do that, I'm gonna push with my chin. I'm gonna push with my right hand on that chin. So it's gonna go like this, right? And then I'm gonna turn to the side, either punch or foot stomp. Okay. So the way this goes is knife hand block. Step, chin strike, push, right? Yeah, there you go, okay? Because you have to use that right leg to sweep, okay? So you're, slight, you're basically kicking back to sweep that leg, okay? And then, of course, you have to reverse it on the other side, all right? But basically, that chin strike comes up like an upper punch, and the hand position is like this, right? So you're kind of cupping the side of the, right there. So the palm of your hand, the, the heel of your hand comes straight up into the chin this way. You can do it forward too, but then you get, you know, you might get fingers inside the nostrils and that's kind of gross, All right? So I like it more sideways, right? Boom, this way, right? So. Right, if you do it straight in front like this, you can, like I said, but then you get spit and nostril juice and stuff like that, and it's kind of gross, so go sideways, all right? But you can certainly do it straight if you want, all right? <laughs> so, any questions? Any questions on those? All right, okay, let's finish up. Our times, I've gone a little bit over, but all right, good job, you guys. You guys are doing great. All right, from here, face me, chit up. And Jongne. All right, have a good night. Have a great weekend. We'll see you guys next week. Bye. All right, let me unmute you. All right, um, any issues on that second part uh, with the, any glitchiness with the video at all? No. It's a little glitchy for me at the beginning, but then it was. Like okay. Let me just a little glitchy. It glitches okay. whenever you ask. It glitches. No, but who? I know, right? <laughs> all right. Well, I'll keep working on it. Keep fixing things up and doing all that stuff. So, um, like I said, if you if you're noticing anything, if you go back and look at the videos on YouTube and you're noticing something as you do that, please just send me a quick email. Yes, sir. I may know so I can adjust it and fix things accordingly. All, all right. right.
Right. Well, great. Uh, great class, you guys, and um, have a wonderful weekend. All right. We'll see you guys hopefully next week sometime. Bye. Bye. Take care. Bye. 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 Bye